Are you a programmer in search of a two-in-one laptop that can keep up with your coding demands? Look no further. In this video, we'll be showcasing the top three best two-in-one laptops for coding in 2023. But don't skip any part of this video, because we'll also be discussing the downsides of each device. So, get ready to take notes and hit that like button as we dive into the best two-in-one laptops for coding. 3. Microsoft Surface Pro 8 When it comes to finding a versatile Windows tablet that can also function as a laptop, the Surface Pro series by Microsoft has consistently delivered. As a coder, I was looking for a device that could handle my workload while still being lightweight and portable, and the Surface Pro did not disappoint. Although the most recent iteration, the Surface Pro 9, has only seen minor upgrades from the previous version, it still boasts impressive features, such as an 11th gen Intel Core processor or an option for a Microsoft SQ3 processor with 5G wireless. However, for most people, we recommend going for the Surface Pro 8 instead, as it has a lower price point without sacrificing too much performance. As a coding machine, the Surface Pro is a fantastic option. It's lightweight and portable, making it easy to bring with you on the go, and its touchscreen capabilities can be useful when working with certain software. The Surface Pen and detachable keyboard are also great features that make it feel like you're using a traditional laptop rather than a tablet. However, there are some downsides to the Surface Pro. Its battery life is not as impressive as some other devices on the market, and its pricing can be a bit steep, especially if you opt for accessories like the keyboard and pen. 2. HP Spectre X360 14 As a coder, I needed a laptop that could keep up with my demanding workload, and the HP Spectre X360 certainly fit the bill. From the moment I laid eyes on it, I was impressed by its solid build quality and attractive design. But what really stood out to me was the crystal clear OLED display once I got used to it. I couldn't imagine going back to a traditional LCD screen. And while the latest model did lose a bit in terms of battery life, it still lasted longer than many other two-in-ones on the market. The Spectre X360 14 u series processor and Intel Iris Say integrated graphics made it perfectly suited for office and productivity tasks. I could effortlessly switch between coding software, web browsers, and messaging apps without any lag. But like any laptop, the Spectre X360 14 had its downsides. While it performed well for coding and office tasks, it might not be the best option for more demanding tasks like gaming or video editing. Additionally, its premium features and build quality come at a premium price, which might not be within everyone's budget. 1. Samsung Galaxy Book 3 Pro 360 As I sat down at my desk, I couldn't help but admire the sleek design of my new Samsung Galaxy Book 3 Pro 360. The laptop's stunning OLED display illuminated the room with vivid colors, and I was immediately drawn to its premium feel. As a coder, I needed a laptop that could keep up with my demanding workload and the Galaxy Book 3 Pro 360 did not disappoint. Powered by a 13th Gen Core i7 processor and Intel Iris Say integrated graphics, this laptop offered lightning-fast performance that made multitasking a breeze. I could effortlessly switch between coding software, web browsers, and messaging apps without any lag. But what really stood out to me was the battery life. The Pro 360's marathon-length battery lasted all day, meaning I could work from coffee shops, libraries, and even on long flights without worrying about finding an outlet. And as if that wasn't enough, the Pro 360 also came with fantastic audio quality a rare find in laptops and a great 1080p webcam, making video calls and meetings a pleasure. But there was one downside to the Pro 360 that I couldn't ignore its price tag. While I considered it a steal for all of the top-of-the-line features and upgrades it offered, it might not be within everyone's budget.